welcome, welcome, welcome to your mom's house with Tom Segura, Tom Segura, and Christina Pajitsin. Welcome to your mom's house. Oh, fuck, I can't believe I didn't have that recorded. <laughs> No, Damn yeah, um, yeah. I wouldn't do that. I wouldn't yeah. do that guy's podcast either. Just to be clear. Yeah. Um, <laughs> no. All right, we're joined here. I just want to make sure I'm right, saying it right. Is it Tome? <laughs> uh, well, yes, yes, yes. Tome, Tome, P- Tome. Do you ever get? Uh, by the way, I, on the phone sometimes it's super frustrating when. I mean, I, I could. I'll say this. I could tell sometimes it's English as a second language person. Uh-huh. They'll be like your name, and I'll tell them. And they're like, I'm sorry. I'm like Tom, and they're like. Could you spell it? I'm like, oh T O M. And they're like, Tom. I'm like, right. Yeah. <laughs> have you not heard this one yet? Is this a new one? Because, like, it should have been one of the ones you've heard a lot so far. If I, you've... I do feel like it's super short. Like, yeah. it would be like a two syllable name, like, you know, at yeah. least. Yeah. Right? Christine, uh, like, people can, mm. like, go with you. Tom, like, it's so. Blech. But it is, it is like, and then you can hear people go, John. I'm like, no, no, no. Right. So I understand that. What's more alarming are the amount of people who are so lazy that they've known us for a while, and they'll be like, "How's Christine doing?" And I'm like, "Oh, that kills Holy shit. Christine. I've known you for five years. Yeah. For five yeah. years, you it's haven't terrible. gotten our name right." Oh, uh, we have these good friends of ours. We thought they were pretty. Good. They're, yeah. they're good friends, but we haven't. And to their in their defense, we haven't seen them in a, like a couple of years. They've been everyone's been traveling. It's, it's been rough. But you know, we were pretty hardcore vacations da, 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 together. That's close. And she said, um, so how and and what grade is your oldest in? I'm like, uh, did you just call uh, Angie the oldest? Yeah. <laughs> it was like, oh man, wow. I guess yeah. I guess uh we were completely out, out of your mind. We, <laughs> you don't think about us at all. No, we forgot. Wow. We forgot. We your, forgot your child's name yeah. who wow. we hung out with and gave Christmas presents to. Sometimes too, you know. It, it's like I'm kind of like defending us because we go and we we meet more people than most people do. Yeah. Right. Because like, you, yes. And so and, you know, there's there are clubs that everybody that you love and you walk into. Right. And you're like, it's so good to be back. Yeah. And sometimes it'll be, you know, let's say six or seven people on that staff. Right. And they all say something to you. And then you're yeah. like, what's up, dude? Yeah. He's like, oh, I call everybody, dude. <laughs> yeah, that's the it's, best way. It's James, bro. And you're like, no, nah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> and they're like, no, and they they'll catch no. you. That's the worst. Can I tell like, you what I just did this week? I'm such a shithead. I was in St. Louis tits. Yeah. And my feature <laughs> act, I go, oh hi, nice to meet you. And and like uh, the first night went by, and by the second night, he goes, you know, we've worked together before. Ah. Uh, Oh, how long ago, bro? <laughs> it was like three years ago. Yeah. I'm such an asshole. You're like, I had a baby. Oh, sorry. Yeah. I had a ba- I, you get a it. pass, though. I think, you Do know, I? yes, headliner, so you get a pass. Yeah. It's you, You're going around, you're meeting so many people, working with so many yeah. people. So popular. Just so popular. So clubs. Yeah. yeah. It's come on. I My know. favorite, sometimes people go, uh, after the show, they go, you remember me? An audience person <laughs> All right. like, uh-huh. from, and they're like, it's fucking San Francisco a couple of years ago. I was the guy that yelled out, it's a pastrami sandwich. And they're like, yes. You, you. You, you yelled that out? Hey, pastrami Jones. <laughs> and you're like, and you're like, and they're like, and then you said the thing back. And you're like, I now I remember now. I just, I forgot for a second. But you, you just, you jostled it from my How about when you're. When the same thing goes down, hey, remember me? You're in San Francisco. Hey, remember me? Yeah. Hey, yeah. How's it going? Good. Pascac Hills High School, right? You remember? Right? Oh, right. Like, <laughs> yeah. when they t- it's not even in that context of yeah. the club. Right. And it's something from your like childhood or your cousin or something. And they're like, yeah. oh, I'm awful, well, I, I guess. I don't remember you at all. Well, they say that yeah. forgetting names is means that you've... Think more about yourself than other people. So, so yeah, that's about right. You know what's wrong with that? <laughs> <laughs> what about faces? I I tend to remember people's faces, but not always the name. Mm-hmm. I mean, that means I'm half observant, maybe. Yeah, like you half. care a little bit. Oh yeah, but yeah, not enough. But not enough. <laughs> yeah. And the truth is, you remember the names of everyone that you want to remember. Right, I, I mean, yes, yeah, right, right Christine, Christine, yeah. <laughs> totally. so unmemorable. I must not be very I mean, memorable to people. I uh, get it a lot. The worst. I just got it today. It was like, I love your podcast, Christine. I'm like, what? Wait, <laughs> how much do you love it? Not that much. 
Yeah. Yeah. It's your dad's house. Much. Yeah. It's your dad's house. Yeah. <laughs> we get that too. About like in the, you know, when you do like press radio, mm-hmm. I think it's like so, it shows like a level of just, it's again, it's like laziness and, and just zero regard when they go yeah. like, uh, and then we have you on the, you know, and so they, they have a computer and they're like, it's yeah. great you're here. It's got a great podcast called, uh, go, go over to you, see your mom. Like, <laughs> I'm like, you couldn't just like type that shit in and read it, man. Yeah. Like, <laughs> so just Google weird. my name. And they're like, what is it called again? I'm like, it's fucking, you have a screen in front of you, <laughs> man. <laughs> you just don't <laughs> care. Yeah. Screw you. Yeah. All right. Yeah. We don't care. Let's open the show. Here Make we go. Make a bridge and get Tom over Pop it. Tom Papa's here. Let's have some fun. Here we go. What's up, all you long nail lovers? Here's Ayana and her lovely long nails. I have a couple of questions that I'm sure all of you are biting at the bits to hear the answers to. Ooh. Ooh. I know the people are dying to know how do you wipe your butt with those long nails? Oh. <laughs> Who is Randy? Don't bring anyone mother to this. Your mom in the fucking stand! Welcome, welcome, welcome to your mom's house with Tom Segura, Tom Segura. and Christina Pajitsin. Christina Pajitsin. Christina Pajitsin. Welcome to your mom's house. You got it? Got Did it. you get Tom's right? Tom's good. Okay. Tom's good. <laughs> Tom. Um, Poo Poo's here. Tom. And <laughs> How much did you hear that growing up? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 It was like a real, yeah, you're like, yeah. But then I owned it and I, I took, I took, I got a better joke with my name. You did? Yeah. It was, because uh, there was like a lot of mama papa, a lot of poopa, a lot yeah. of that. <laughs> and then I came up with papa boner. Oh. oh. And uh, it was it was the mic drop in third grade. Sure, <laughs> isn't that awesome though? That's yeah, like, that's the best thing about yeah. comics is like yeah. they figure out a way to own the like reverse the yeah. bullying, and they're like, "Now nah, you fucking love me, <laughs> right?" Yeah. Yeah. If he could do that to his own name, what could he yeah. do to mine? Oh man, that's so great. <laughs> yeah, where did you grow up again? New Jersey, Jersey. North Jersey, North Jersey. Is that like close to Philly? Or is no, that, that's, that's South, South Jersey. Jersey. Okay, North Jersey is like thirty minutes outside of New York. Oh, okay, and um. Yeah, like uh, right on the border of like New York State. Yeah, it was a uh, it was a cool spot to grow up. Yeah, Giant Stadium more than Eagle Stadium. Uh, Meadowlands. Is that yes. A, okay. Yes. Mm. Are you still a big Giants fan? I am. It's cool to have that. Like, that's the thing about sports that, like, you know, I think is great. The longer you know you're around, is like having a little piece of home. And having some emotional attachment to it, yeah, makes that's what that's the fun part of sports. Like I never yeah. get when someone's like, "Yeah, I love sports. I don't really care who." I'm like, then you're not getting the thrill of it. The right. thrill <laughs> is that you're either really excited or super bummed out and angry. Yeah, that's the fun part. Yeah, so you're having like a pretty good time, I guess, right now. I mean, it's up and down all the time, but like. Giants are a fun team to follow. Yeah, they stink this year, though. There's a lot of chaos. But I'm also a Yankee fan, and they just got in the playoffs. And I come, my whole house is girls who, and yes. nobody cares. Thank yeah. God. So I just like walk around the house like all yesterday. Yankees are in the playoffs. Let's hear it. And they're just like, oh, please. God, we don't know what that dream. means, but yeah. we know we don't like it. <laughs> That's how I feel. Yeah. I, I don't it's care. completely. Nah. Yep. And I went through periods, especially when I was first dating my wife. Where I was like, yeah, you know, I watch a little baseball, but I was never like a all in sports guy, like all the time. Yeah. But then like once we had kids and moved along and stuff, I started watching more sports because it was just a way to shut down and just kind of like tune them out. Yeah. Tune everything out. Yeah. 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 It's great. That's why Tom, especially Tom them. loves it. It's though. great for <laughs> disconnecting from your life. Yeah. 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 Wife. Did you say wife? Yeah. Yeah. Wife. 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 <laughs> right. <Yeah. laughs> Yeah. <laughs> like, I can't hear you. Yeah. I can't hear you. It's interesting because sport talk is a shorthand for gentlemen. Like, if you'll notice, every time we do have a, a guy guest, and which is mostly all our guests now, it's like sports first. 
And oh, then, we get it out of the way. Yeah, and yeah, then yeah. you're like, what's your team? What's your team? All right, good. And then you can go on yeah, with like it's, everything else. It's like your, your butt sniff. You yeah, know? <laughs> it really is. Right, yeah. Yeah. yeah, it's strange. Mm. And then when you meet someone who's not into it at all, and uh, it's kind of unsettling in a way. It's a like man? even if you're not, re- yeah, e- yeah, anyone. It's weird, it's, right? yeah. yeah, actually, yeah. yeah I don't true. expect. I don't expect girls to like. Like I don't that. follow baseball at all. Uh huh. But sometimes I'll meet a guy and he'll be like, "Well, you know, I don't like really anything but baseball." And I'll be like, "Yeah, okay, but I get that. Like you, right? You like one of the things, right? <laughs> right. Like, yeah. Yeah, yeah. You like something with a ball. Yeah. <laughs> 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 that we don't have to be really smart to enjoy. <laughs> now, I hit up Tom before the show, and he was like, "I have a huge long nail fetish. Do you have anything yeah. like that?" <laughs> and then, is I, that uh, right? I love them. Yeah. I mean, and the longer the better. Huh? He's, this is emailed from his file. I'll say one of my favorite <sighs> files. So crazy. Um, but anyways, they asked this lady <laughs> how she. I, I actually. Would think that too, right? If you saw these crazy long nails, be like, how do you do any number Anything. of things but wipe? How does she wipe her butt? How does she pick her nose? How does she wipe her butt? How does she wear shoes? Ugh. 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 All of it. Are you going to take a shit? Oh. Oh. <gasps> okay. So we can finally put this Scissor in. Exactly. Uh. Uh, take a roll of paper like this. Looks like you got it on a paper towel. Yeah. <laughs> And then I do it like this. Uh, They've got a smell. Oh, uh, yeah. Stuff. <laughs> Nasty. Oh, wait. Does she? Did you see the clip in the beginning? And I don't want to direct you, but did you see when they glanced by her foot? Yeah, yeah. Those yeah, are yeah, long, yeah, too, yeah. right? Yeah, those are yeah. long, too. Oh, We're going to talk about I, that, I'm too. I'm pretty sure <laughs> this lady was on TLC. I think we shot. We saw, oh, really? Like a, a, a super produced segment on her. Yeah. Oh, my God. Wait, but. So, okay, right. so she, but look how much she's got to use so much okay, paper. <laughs> this well, one needs a bidet. Yes. Over. Right. This. Okay. 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 And then I take it and I put it in my right hand. Uh uh-uh. uh. No. This is just. I'm on I, tender I, hooks right now. And then I took my butt up in the air. <laughs> and then. <laughs> yeah. There's a paper. She should only but eat what makes her not poop. Yeah. yeah. And I take it and do this. And make sure you get all up in there. All up in there. See? All right. See, I don't so, know if she can uh, get all up in there. She doesn't get all up in there. That's the thing. What about, there, about when she has a real <laughs> sloppy one? No. And you really got to <laughs> really wipe. No. She needs a permanent bidet. The washlet. Yeah. She needs a hose. Yeah. yeah. In a yard. Yeah. <laughs> and a man <laughs> that sprays it in there. Right. Someone with dead, deadly accuracy uh. to... Uh, <laughs> Because this is just... Just hands up against the fence. Right. <laughs> and it's time to blast. Uh-huh. And you just, like, let her collect it throughout the day, and then at 6 o'clock at night, that's when you hose her off. That, what, <laughs> what, are you, what are you um doing with your life? You're not. Where, but as I'm saying, like, yeah. why would you inconvenience yourself just to be like, I'm the super gross long nails person? That's her identif. It's her marker. It, it is, right? It's like, I'm the parrot guy. I'm the exotic pet guy. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm the boa the, guy. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the well, albino boa. Yeah. You know, it's funny. We watched the we, we watched the whole segment on this guy in Mexico with the world's biggest penis. Uh-huh. And it turns out that, uh, I mean, it was absolutely... Enormous. We're talking like down to the ankle. But what they discovered when they did these CAT scans was that the penis actually was under all this extra skin. It was like, uh-huh. so penis actually was, let's say, whatever, seven inches. Yeah. And then he had overgrown skin. Just extra trunk. Like calloused yes. skin. Yeah, like, like Al Roker extra skin. Yes, yeah, like, like that. <laughs> right. That had grown and and, uh. and, give, and, give, and give, would give you the illusion if right. you're just looking like that's all penis, but it really is <laughs> excess skin. So then they go, and, and like this guy can't go, like he can't walk. It just <laughs> right. flops against his legs and it's like. It's, it's debilitating. Just, yeah, it's yeah. like an elephant trunk. Right. So then they go, this, these doctors were like, you, you know, you can't even enjoy life with this. <laughs> They offered to do a surgery where like, we'll, we'll remove all this excess skin and still leave you with your above average penis. Right. But let you kind of function instead of living this way, but which was like a, a horrible, they showed like his quality of life. Was, and he was like, nah, <laughs> I like having this crazy huge penis and people being like, whoa, like looking at me like, the fuck is that thing? Yeah. So I'd rather right. have that. Right. Than you then you give me back like a normal life. 
something. Yeah, he wants to be special. Yeah, right. Yeah. Because if he, they, they take that away from him, he's got to come up. He's got to develop a skill or a hobby. Or that's right. He's got to sing. He's got to be something to be special. <laughs> that's true. Now he's like, here you go, ladies. Yeah, <laughs> rummage through this laundry basket and see if you can find it. <laughs> it's so big, and he's like, it just drips all day. <laughs> like it's, just, it's so huge. It's so man. complicated, and yeah. it's it's not even functional. He can't have intercourse with people. He can't. No. Oh. Can he just yeah. drape it over them? <laughs> Like a he like just, a parachute. It's wrapped up in like a gauze. Like yeah. he doesn't even oh. keep it. it it's a, it's just so un, unusable. Yeah. Wow, it's, it's really debilitating. It's weird. He kind of treats it like a. It's like a, asking a Siamese twin if they want to split. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, here but it is. The, but your Siamese twin can't okay. talk. Here it there is. There he is. <laughs> yeah. So like, here's how it hangs. Oh yeah. wow! And, and there's just cloth. It's like a horse. And like wrapped. <laughs> there's stuff wrapped on it. Yeah, he's got. Yeah, it'll just chafe. Oh, that's not for decoration. <laughs> <laughs> I thought maybe he was in like a Mexican parade or something. <laughs> it's a pinata. But see, it's like oh. a Dora flame. Log. This is like okay. This is from the Oof. like the, no. the cat scan thing. Uh huh. It's like penis is here oh, in the middle. Skin. That's you're saying? Well, like that. But the, this is penis. Uh huh. This is like. Skin on right. the outside, and they're excess, like, "Oh, yeah. your your penis actually ends way before all this excess growth." I'm so confused. It I looks know. like they skinned a horse. I know this is just like a high whatever a topography <laughs> scan, but Tom, you don't understand the medical. Look Oof. at this thing! Wow. I'd say that is. Ooh. You know what I like though is that whoever's searching for the penis guy is also interested in Diana, here's a, here's Princess a, of Wales. Look at look at him. That guy can't. But go. that's why he does it for yeah. that moment. Yeah. This yeah. photo, right? Just right. that's the thing, right? Yeah. Just to walk for people past to the go, cafe. <gasps> yeah. Just for those faces. You know? Yeah. Like he wants those faces. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, what is? <laughs> look at his apartment. What else has he got going on? Yeah, I know. That, you know, this is the, it. That's the truth. Is a look at the apartment. Yeah. Hey, that's his whole life. Yeah. Is, hey, is ladies. That. Hey, ladies. I can make that work. <laughs> Why couldn't he have sex with that? It looks like he could. Well, uh, I mean, with, <laughs> I don't know. I think with a normal penis, sized woman, but no, because it's all it's all like hardened skin. The the last inches of it are it's just calloused skin. It's not even a penis. Oh, it's like overgrowth of a skin. You can still give it kisses if you want. <laughs> you want to do that? You could hug. Do you? Could you hug it? Yeah. Could you cuddle with it? <laughs> totally. Yeah. Shop Talk with it? it? Yeah. You could hide little peanuts in the top of it and see if your dog or <laughs> your squirrels can find it. <laughs> <laughs> that um, is really creepy. What, I think so, but I, she grew yeah. it. Like she, she is as deliberate. Yes. Yeah. But what what's worse though? Do you think the hands or the the feet? Oof. That's the real question. I mean, uh, the feet. feet. Just, the feet seem like a much <laughs> bigger inconvenience. You know, I mean, like uh, these are terrible enough. The doors know. and handshakes, but like those, you can't put shoes on those tootsies. <laughs> no. Uh, I mean, yeah. let's just if we could just remove it from the convenience for her. How about? <laughs> What, how disgusted we are! I say <laughs> the feet. I can't even. I can't look at feet normally. Now you got these big jabber claws coming off. Hey guys, I'm Carla yeah, Claus. I um. Oh, I'm gonna what see. Was that? I'm it's pretty so upset as I think I found. I think this is her on the TLC show. Oh God! See. Uh, oh. That's so much worse. Has That's so much worse. That is her. Extreme toenails prevent her from getting the exercise she needs. See, she's like, I can't exercise. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Uh, it's God. the feet. The feet. The feet. That big toe. Way worse. Today, way worse, sir. Vincent is taking <laughs> and way worse, sir. The only way to normalize this <laughs> is she found the dude who's like, man, that's awesome. I love that shit. You he's know, like, like there's oh. a guy who's like, this is perfect. Well, it's that's, the enabler. It's yes. the guy who's like, I'll take care of you. I'll drive you everywhere. I'll yep. put your sneakers on, cut yep. the toes off so that the, the nails can dangle. Oh, I'll paint them for you. I'll make you. sure yeah. I punch anyone that gets with yeah. me uh, two yards yeah, of you. That's, that's his identity. Yeah. What are you protector. looking at? Yeah. What are you looking at? <laughs> Sorry, sorry. She's just shopping, just like the rest of you. What do you? <laughs> right. Yeah, that's right. right. He's that guy, right? He's that guy. His job is to get offended at everyone else's normal reaction. Right. Oh, you never what? saw a foot before? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> right. You never saw an elegant lady's foot? N- not, not like that. <laughs> <laughs> elegant lady's foot. Ah. Uh, oh, that God, big toe is so bad. Oh, okay. It's so much worse than everything else. Cut her toenails. <laughs> Oh, this so, is a dance class. Five? No. Uh-uh. Uh, oh, my 
my God. Don't step on my foot, Vincent. Five, six, seven. Yeah. Get a little close. Get a little too close. See? One, and she's two, got the big scissor hands around his back <laughs> <laughs> as the as the toes are coming in for and his she chin. She was telling him, like, getting a little too close. Like, that's your life. Your life is like, watch out for these nails. Yeah. <laughs> Don't oh. ever <laughs> touch my nails, man. <laughs> God. She can't work. There's she can't no way. Text. How does she text? No. That's yeah. the most important thing. You're right. Yeah. <laughs> How's she yeah. swiping? That is true. <laughs> uh, what's his, but what's his problem? Uh, I don't know. Come he, on. He needs the enabling identity. Maybe his yeah. he yeah. feels special being next to someone that he's perceiving as special. <laughs> you know? That's the thing. He's like, this person's special right here, man. They got like, crazy nails <laughs> and they've befriended me. Like that is a special Guardian. place to be. But what if he met her and she was just kind of like regular nails? And oh, then they right. slowly started to grow. Oh. And right. then he's like, So, baby, you think, you think about what are you thinking about doing? You want to go to the spa this weekend? <laughs> I got yeah. you a gift certificate. <laughs> <laughs> They'll do both, tops and bottoms. Don't even worry about it. <laughs> do you think he met her after it was big? Yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah. That's this has special. been her for a while. Uh, the thing is, if you've ever had long toenails, you know you know when they're uncomfortable. Like when you yeah. put on your sneakers and you're like, "Ooh, this is time to cut that big toe." Yeah, like it's time to go. Yeah, could you yeah. imagine like going past that? Uh, I can't stand it for like a day. Uh, she can't lay in bed with someone. No. Right. I mean, imagine like that cutting you. You'd be mm-hmm. like, "Ow, fuck!" Like <laughs> that would be like for real, like a knife, like somebody kicking you with a knife. Oh, that's nasty. Uh, she is the worst. She is the worst. <laughs> She's back with her duty. She definitely doesn't get all her shit when she wipes. Put in the garbage. Garbage. Come on, garbage. If I need some more, I get some more. Actually, what is I this? do. Like, Mexico I City? Where are you doing this? Hang on. And it's then quite I take a lot. the baby wipes. Oh, the baby, oh, baby wipes. wipes. Gotta know. be clean. Gotta be clean, girl, because so, people think that we're nasty and we're not. They clean. Well, no, no. Yeah. Get that yeah. I'll take- Everybody voted here. <laughs> yeah. We're <laughs> nasty. Okay. We're dealing with the nasty. <laughs> yeah. Maybe that's you the are. next segment for this show, nasty or not. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Say nasty. She gets it. Some of y'all is nasty as hell. <laughs> She's nasty. <laughs> I like how baby wipe kind of just, just takes away any kind of bad feeling. Right. Well, we have a baby wipe. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, well, it's not just it. regular paper. And you think we're nasty now, but look, I got a thing of baby wipes. Yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. it kind when, of did make it feel better for me. We're nasty. Do you think she's talking about like long nail crew? Like she's like people think that <laughs> people like us with these nails as a collective yeah. identity. What's going on with her? Schnitzel. What's the matter? Hey, schnitzel. Oh, schnitzel. She hates long nails too. That's what this is all about. <laughs> yeah, she's like, move on. This is disgusting. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I have to tell you something that happened to me. Uh, a TSA agent, I was flying to St. Louis Tits this weekend. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And I had on a Comedy Works sweatshirt, and it mm. said, you know, Comedy Works Denver on the side. And uh, the t- TSA agent looks at me, and she goes, yes, it does. Comedy does work. <laughs> oh, that's great. And I was like, oh, that was sweet. Yeah, yeah. it's a good one. Made me happy. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> All you got to do is laugh. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, that's great. I, I mean, never I've thought of those that. words that way. Yeah, no, yeah. neither did I. But yeah. I guess if you didn't know it was a comedy club, you'd think that, too. Like, oh, what a positive positive lady that is wearing that yeah. sweatshirt you got to tell the crew that comedy works yeah. and he said that that's really cool. comedy and prayer they both work <laughs> you know, the two main things that get me through life right. you know, <laughs> laughter and god right. uh, <laughs> praise comedy jesus <laughs> man yeah that's, that's good so that's good. a good one yeah she was sweet speaking of um all right blind people Somebody, we get we get a lot of questions about the deaf and the blind, and right? <laughs> oh, I had, wrote, oh, before you jump into yeah. that, just off of blind people, it happened to me at a club this week. A guy comes up with his blind friend, and he goes, can we, "Hey, can we get a picture? Dave's blind, and he's got the stick, and you know, and he's clearly blind." I say, "Yeah, sure, of course, come on over here," you know. And uh, his, so it's me, the I'm me, the blind guy's in the middle, and his friend's on the other side, and his friend has him turn the other way, no. so it's the back of his head, <laughs> and I'm like, and I said to the blind guy, hey, he's messing with you, he's like, he does this every time, just let it go, <laughs> I'm never going to see it. <laughs> That's great, uh, isn't that so great? Funny. I love that. To have yeah. a blind so friend funny. you just mess with? Yeah, oh, I love it. So I love that. Um Email says, hello, mommies. I have a totally blind neighbor that walks his dog around the neighborhood every day. The other day coming home, I see him picking up his small dog's poop. How do blind people know their dog is pooping? And not just smelling something or taking a break. (laughs) How do they find it and pick it up? 
Keep them high and tight. Big <laughs> fan, Michael. See, on the surface, that seems like a stupid question, but now that I think about it, yeah, how yeah, would they Yeah, but this know? goes back to degrees of blindness also. Right, because, sure. you know, you, somebody can be legally blind or, you know, medically they're, they're considered blind and disabled in, in that regard, but they might be have, you know, just see, they can't drive, but they see shadows and shapes. Right, right, and then right. there's like, Blackout, total blindness. That's totally hmm. different. I think this is probably his neighbor is probably somebody that has some visual ability. You know, mm-hmm. I'm saying he's totally blind. You think so? Yeah, just so, figuring it out. Super blind, really good stick, dog. Yeah, he's out there with him, and then you just wait for all of the grunting to start. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> right. I yeah, mean, you guys don't have because your dog's so small, but. You have a big dog. <laughs> they, it's like a man. Like, oh, yeah. No. Yeah. Yeah. Are you being yeah. serious? Yeah. It's yeah. Like, Whew, I was what doing to do that all day. True. <laughs> My dog talks. Uh, no, there's no grunting. But you, you know what it is? The jingle jangle of like they're walking, walking, right. and then they do that circle. Yeah. When they're getting true. ready. It's true. Ching, 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 ching. Maybe I mean, he has a poop bell on him. Oh, maybe, finding yeah. the specific place to grab though is kind of dicey. Right, I mean, even yes. with yeah. perfect vision, you're like, oh, you, you, you're real careful usually when yes. you pick that up. You know, yeah, that's a good point. Yeah, because I, I don't see that great, and um, but I, you know, I can see, and it's hard to find my dogs sometimes. Yeah, especially when she just goes in the backyard. Well, maybe so we've been getting a lot of feedback. Maybe some blind people can can. Maybe way back in. maybe this blind person's faking it. I've done that there before too. Where I you're like, like fake uh, being blind. No, <laughs> 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 I like the way Christina thinks. Oh, <laughs> not fake being blind, just fake fake pickup. And somebody oh, fake like, oh, I can't oh, see anything. Pick, oh, get up! Oh, no, you ever yeah. fake fake? Dog you are pick up? you are one of those people. For I totally sure. am. Like I can't. I don't have the time for this. And I pretend <laughs> like I'm picking it up, awful. but I don't. Just awful. It's terrible. Yeah. <laughs> I am terrible, yeah. I feel bad when I walk the dog and then, um, like, she goes or I forget a bag. Yeah. Yeah. And, yes. And that's always when they, when she goes to the bathroom in front of yeah. the neighbors, they're coming yeah. out of their door. So maybe now I'll just, as we meek, meekly go up the street, I'll just yell, I'm blind. <laughs> <laughs> Give me a break. I'm blind. <laughs> <laughs> I'm totally, by the way, yeah. I, I have done the, uh, yeah. The walk where I have to, fuck, I forgot the bag. Yeah. And I've done the like. Yeah, the, of course. The, the fake. The fake, like, fake. The fake, yeah. <laughs> You're like, oh, Here God, this stuff stinks. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. Before I had a dog, I would always say that dog people are the worst because they, they you'd always find stuff. And yeah. they, like they never, you know. And then once you have a dog, you realize they're not just, they're not bad people. They're just. It's struggling. Yeah, it's <laughs> there's struggling. some yeah. days you forget. You forget. There's some days you there's forget. Some days you're just lazy too. I just uh, <laughs> or some days it's just dark out. And I went who up cares? our street, <laughs> and that right that we take a ride on, a big, a big dog shit flattened, so like someone stepped on it. And then the next day, I went the same route, and there was a new no. one next to it. So like this dog is shitting on the sidewalk, <laughs> and the person walking is like, yeah, that's where you shit. Keep shitting here. There's a collection of these big dog shits there. Oh, God. Uh, it's gnarly. Nasty. It's super nasty. Well, our dogs are t- are tiny. Yeah. So they make like cat shits. It's it's never like, you know, big no. fucking, you know, come that's, on. Yeah, I wish we had a small dog. I, I wanted a small dog. Well, as your dad used my, to say to you, what did my, he say? My father always, the reason we had small dog, he says, because a big dog makes big shit. Small dog makes small shit. Always get small dog. There you go. <laughs> For that very reason. Yeah. He, he's a poet. Yeah. <laughs> Yes, he's he right. Yes, he, is he is totally right. Yeah. He's right. And like, yeah, the jumping up on people, they get excited and say hello. It's at your ankle. It's no big deal. Yeah. My dog's like a horse. Yeah. What, what is it? A, a lab. A black oh, lab. They're so cute. They are cute, great dogs. But man, I mean, people come over. She, she jumps up. She's like the same yeah. height as them. Yeah. And she does. I mean, she... She shits like a man. <laughs> it's no joke. It's no joke. Now, yeah. do you, but can she shit in your backyard? Yeah, she's ruined the yard. So do you, we're literally right. My wife right now is with a guy trying to figure out how to fix the yard. We we uh we created oh, dog shit dog shit alley. You, you got to do like it. Fenced off an area. And uh-huh. like, this is where that's you shit where they it. shit. And you train them. Hell yeah. It? It's yeah. not very... I'll show you how to do it. Because right. at the, our old house, I let them shit everywhere. Yeah. And then the whole lawn is ruined. And ruined. it's like a minefield. But if you tell them, like, this is your one area, 
You just train them. Okay, come on, dog shit alley. And then they only go there. Will she do now, it just for peeing also? No, brown brown and yellow. But really? the thing is, it's going to mess up the grass there. There, But yeah. it's rather That's in okay. one area. It's in one than, spot. Yeah. yeah. I mean, it looks like a... It just, I mean, it's, it's just all burned out, the yeah. whole thing. We're yeah. thinking about paving it. Oh. Yeah. We're thinking about just putting like a... <laughs> Seriously, like put, making it into a patio. Yeah, I understand that. Uh, oh, well, uh, give it a whirl. <laughs> this one. <laughs> Hi, guys. I'm new to the podcast. I've been thinking about this for years, and I think you might have some insight to offer. Do retarded people dream in retarded? That is terrible. <laughs> or do they dream just like you and I? Are all the dream? Are all the people in their dreams retarded? I really like to know. <laughs> Thanks, guys, Daniel. That is a very <laughs> insensitive <laughs> question, but I have to say you have piqued my interest. I also would like to know from somebody if... Uh, if no, wait. <laughs> <laughs> let me clarify the question. The question is, do they, is, are the themes of the dreams retarded no, or no. are all the people no, in them no, retarded? No, no. Retarded? <laughs> no. What they're asking is... <laughs> <laughs> They're not asking about retarded themes. Like, They're is it all about ice cream? <laughs> oh, this is all right. I am. I am. You're, this is absolutely shameless. Um, they're saying. Is a retarded person well, Because we asked before Like does a retarded person Know they're retarded Right And we've had a lot of people Weigh in And like uh, people that teach Special ed class and <laughs> She makes me laugh So it's so inappropriate, so inappropriate To even ask But this question yeah. Is about dreams <laughs> And whether or not The dreams are filled With people that are Oh Also Retarded Oh. Oh, just the just the other just the I other think actors so. I in think it. That, I think not that. not just what's going on. Yeah, I think so. I mean, I wonder. <laughs> like, do you? They're not, <laughs> they're not just really excited in the mall to see somebody. It's not that kind of stuff. It's, it's like just <laughs> all chocolate. It's, everything's chocolate. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, I was did a show this weekend, and there were um, where were you? Two by the people. Way? I was at a. Uh, Comics in Mohegan Sun. Oh, okay, yeah. And uh, they said uh. that um, there were two special ed teachers. Uh, there was a lot of special ed teachers, actually. It was like two in one show, and it was like a theme. And um, when I was a kid, we had special ed. It was just for the kids who smoked pot and gave the <laughs> right. teacher the finger. Right. Yeah. Right? And they were like, no, these are like really special needs. They're like, you know, they really... Yeah, they really... Yeah, yeah it's, it's evolved. Retarded. The genre's evolved since uh, we went to school, is what you're saying. Yeah. Yeah. yeah you know it's what? different. It's legit. Had, we had to do volunteer work our senior year of high school. Uh -huh. So a friend of mine and I, as seniors, we went to this special needs school, and we would volunteer during our lunch hour there. Right. The one thing that blew my mind was the range of kids that were in yeah. the school. Yeah, yeah. There were kids that had... Attitude problems Right mm. Next to kids that could not speak mm. Like right. they were in a chair And couldn't move limbs And, and you know like right. Basically had zero ability to really <laughs> participate Right Sorry. I'm just thinking about the question again <laughs> <laughs> I, I was too Because I was thinking about that kid And I was like I wonder if he dreams If he's just like Hello how are you Yeah <laughs> You know what I mean Like he's yeah. in this shell where he can't get out and he's, you know, people think he's retarded, but then in his dream, is he like a, a recurring character of like a really good looking businessman? <laughs> you know right. what I mean? Maybe. That's actually really interesting, though. Is That's, he like stacked? Is he like built? The, is the he... worst thing would be waking up, man. You'd, like have, you'd have these awesome dreams. You'd be like, yeah. ah. Oh, you wake up and be like, huh. Oh, and like, God. Oh, he's awake. <laughs> 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 oh, what a bummer uh, um, Well, I'd have to imagine To answer the question I'm, th I'm thinking about it I mean, I can dream about Retarded people Even though I'm not retarded So maybe the converse is true of the Have you though? Past. Have you ever? Dreamt of retarded Not that I'm aware of I mean, not yet Maybe tonight Because <laughs> we're talking about it You have very vivid <laughs> dreams You remember your dreams a lot I dreamt about prosciutto this morning Close your eyes Ooh. Go ahead Retarded, 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 retarded <laughs> Just look at that dreams. picture up there. Yeah, look at that picture <laughs> of that guy. Mm. <laughs> Christina is more of a psycho. Hi, oh, Hitlers. Thanks. I just listened to your most recent po episode, had to write it. Christina's <laughs> argument that she is less psycho and has a little thing called empathy is false. Okay. Here is why. Where Tom laughs at the pain of others, 
The pain is generally brought on through their own actions. Christina, however, laughs at mental illness. All the time. Which in many yeah. cases the person can't help. Clearly she is the main <laughs> Hitler. <laughs> that's from culture. Yeah. That's, that's a really good that's point. That's a good point. Do you uh, laugh Do you want to defend it? At no. like painful, you know, experiences of others? Like I feel like it's a defense. No, can you please show? Do we have the video? That, I can pull it up. Look, I'm going to show you a video. We're going to okay. show you a video. And... You just react to it however. I'm not going to set him up too much. Just okay. react how you want. Right. Like, how I naturally will. Now, this is interesting that I, I'm i laughing at stuff that's involuntary. Let's say mental illness is involuntary. Uh-huh. Whereas this person's saying that those who harm themselves, that's a voluntary thing. Oh. Right. Uh, interesting. So, I understand. But let's see the video. All right. All right. All right. I mean, it's just like, first of all, <coughs> I don't know. Everybody has a different reaction, but I, I've found that. Just let Tom <laughs> watch it, please. Okay, Tom's watching it. And it's Tom, by the way. Tom. Tom. Poop, poop, poop. No, Wait, how, about this? how about his level of interest? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's the driver. Like, well. How'd that happen? Why are you so loud? No, the driver's like, you wrecked my car. Look at, right? look, he's like, well. <laughs> Mess up the bumper. Walked away. He just walks away. Doesn't even ask. He obviously doesn't like him. Doesn't give a fuck about that dude. <laughs> I don't know if it's funny they got hit or it's funny if the reaction is funny. There we go. The reaction, go. like the way, whatever... The fun word he uses for a holy shit yeah. is pretty funny. Yes. Yeah. 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 And the sound. Is it, is it that sound that you're liking? And, and, yeah. his, and his look. Yeah, He's and looking the face. At you like, what did you do? <laughs> <laughs> you don't think this is funny? Um, I mean, no, because I... I sense that he's in a lot of pain. I feel badly for him. And right. I don't yeah. really like. I don't like the fact that no one's helping him and stuff. But yeah, that's just me. But if he if he reacted the way that you expect people in pain to react, like, oh my god, help me. Yeah. I'd I'd have the I'd have empathy for him, but that he's just <laughs> making this crazy face and screaming <laughs> these funny duck noises. Um, it's pretty much so the explanation. It overrides. So, that, <laughs> so this is the this is the, the whole thing. The reaction that Tom is talking about. That it's it's a reaction, it's how he's reacting yeah. versus that. Right. that yeah. he's being <laughs> and this guy can't drive. He's like fucking yeah. hurts. <laughs> you stupid asshole. Well, my poor guy is like part of it. Pretty too, great I word. Think. Is if it were at all mm. in English, it would be different. Yes. Right? Uh, yeah. Like, I'd be like, you fucking kill me. My shins. Yeah. You'd my, be like, <laughs> my knee. <laughs> when, you, when you just hear That's sounds, good point. it's like it's funny. Call my wife. <laughs> <laughs> That's like heavy. Right. He, Mafuga. <laughs> <Yeah>. That's <laughs> yeah. hilarious. It's pretty funny. <laughs> Wow, Christina well, loses another one. That's a really interesting analysis, though. That that really yeah. now I understand. Mafuga, <laughs> that's funny. <laughs> now, I don't want to assume your you have children. Their pronouns. Are you open to sharing them or no? They, they, okay, they, they and they use them's, them. them's, and they them's kids. <laughs> Do those do them kids? That's how they identify as, do, as them. Do they? Do they? The, what? They identify as them. They identify as those. As those. Okay. Those. And were they born with? Did you project <laughs> your own pronoun on them when they were born? Like, were you yes. Like, what did you label them as? Um, hermaphrodites. You did. Yes. Wow. And they. Um, disagreed and went to 
th- to them. No, too. those, I believe. He said and those. And then we decided that they should be girls. Whoa. Oh, Bold. wow. Bold. That's what child abuse. <laughs> yeah. No, my, uh, my wife is in school now. She's going for her degree. Really? And, yeah. Oh. And she um, is in What's a gender out? class. Oh, really? A whole semester. Of they and those and thems. Oh, really? Fascinating. Fascinating. It's endless. It's endless. And your wife and is a woman. My wife is a woman. Okay. And um, we have two girls. Um, and the thing for my wife as a mother, when she was in the, in the class, that you can't say that uh, there was one guy there who said she she said he was obviously trying to get laid. Like he looked cool. Yeah. He was oh like, Oh my God, we talk about these guys all the time. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Like the light skinned black guy with the cool hair yeah. and the cool jewelry. And yeah. just listen to the discussion and then raises his hand. He's like, I don't know. I'm just feeling really, I'm just feeling really sad for those babies. Like those babies, they're split up into boys and girls. And I don't, I don't know. I'm just, <laughs> It's hard not to cry when I think about those babies oh, and my wife as a mother, you know, in her forties in the in the back of the room, like, oh Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you know. Yeah. Because yeah. every dude, this is off topic, <laughs> but every dude picks a lane to get laid. Right. Some guys <laughs> yeah. are more overt with their choice. Right. And they're just like, I play sports. I'm good at it. You wanna fuck? <laughs> like that's their thing. All right. And some guys are like, I'm gonna I'm going to show my emotions all the time. Right. I'm going to be real deliberate, but I'll hide it and make it seem like. Yeah, that I care. But it's all calculated. A lot of shoulder rubs in class. Yeah. (laughs) Yeah. The shoulder Um, rub guy. He's the shoulder rubs. Right. After Um, a heated discussion, do you want to get coffee (laughs) and talk about this? (laughs) I just couldn't believe he said that. (laughs) Um, That's the you look tense guy. Yeah. Uh, mm. There's a guy. Now that guy. So, you know, now I have a kid, too. Uh, you, You know, even if I were to label Ellis a girl i'd be like you're a she it doesn't matter i feel like that gender shit happens on its own yeah. you know what i'm saying yeah. like my boy likes dirt and yeah. trucks and i've done nothing to really to influence that like i don't hand right. him you know what i mean that, no that exactly stuff just happens yeah. it's pretty yeah organic. yeah and there are kids like we didn't we didn't know kids who obviously we didn't know if they identified as a girl but you knew he was very effeminate you know very effeminate and attracted to girl type things but this is what's funny about my wife's class. If you just said that, you're constantly on the lookout for how you're screwing up. Right. Like, oh, boy. So I just said, so he, in the very effeminate doing girl things, well, what do you mean girl things? Dollies, what, babies. Why is that girl? It is. Because is it is. Because my son yeah, doesn't give yeah, a shit yeah. for those things. But that's what the whole class right. is. And she says she sits in class and all the people like within earshot around her are all like, no, there's girl things and there's boy things. Right, right, right. Don't you tell the teacher. No, you do <laughs> No one, everyone feels it. Everyone knows it, but no one wants to say it out loud because yeah. you'll get in trouble. Yeah. The teacher. Well, That's hilarious. He was yeah. in a toddler's class last week and they brought out baby dolls and all the girls got excited, pulled them out. My son took one look. It was like, fuck that. And ran across. Like, doesn't <laughs> even want, he's not interested. Yeah, yeah. Not but interested. But then is, isn't the teacher being like, he should play with this the, doll? Then the teacher told me that we he should <clears throat> Excuse me. Play with the, he. We should kind of force this shit on. I go. Listen. I'm not trying to raise him to be a macho man. I teach him to be gentle with animals and with whatever. But if he doesn't want to play with the doll, he's not going to play with the doll today. Sorry. Yeah. I'm not going to force him to do. He's you know, two. So <laughs> my kids so play with take it up guns, with them, bro. Yeah. <laughs> you know? Don't worry about it. I clean guns in front of them. <laughs> yeah. This is what you're going to do. Yeah. Man. It's yeah. Snakes, rats. And anyone ever gives you problems school, you you know you punch them in the That's face. That's right. You know? We teach him that stuff yeah. at home. Just like healthy male behavior. <laughs> so wait, tell me more about the get. Getting laid, guys. So it's the yeah. It's, and how old is he? Wait so probably wait till next class. Probably she's gonna be like, you know, I got a shoulder rub today. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it was I was I was class. It was it was really upsetting. I brought up that thing about the babies, and I got really mad. But then, uh, <laughs> but then Xander. Carlos took yeah. me over the side, and we went for coffee. He's a lot deeper than I thought. <laughs> it's not just the jewelry. <laughs> he saved sea turtles. <laughs> 
<laughs> and that's funny because a yeah. lot of girls so phone fall into that. Seen and shared thousands of times on social media. Taken on a South Glens Falls high school bus involving freshman Aaron Sweener and friend Leo Washington, who say the driver told students that girls and boys need to sit on different sides of the bus due to couples in the past behaving inappropriately. The pair <laughs> okay. identify as trans non-binary, meaning they don't see themselves as male or female, but proceeded to oh. sit on the boy's side. Then they say the driver got angry. We kept trying to explain to him the situation, like our gender identity and situation, and he was saying that he didn't care. This is his bus, and he's not starting the bus until he gets what he wants. He said that after I told him that I was comfortable and I'm going to sit where I'm comfortable. The pair were then kicked off and waited for another bus to bring them home. Thursday morning, Sweener says the school's principal and other faculty stood behind the two. Just be like, hey, um, hi, how, how are you? What's your name? What's your pronoun? So they got kicked off That's, that bus. But that bus driver's an idiot. Yeah, yeah. bus driver's an asshole. Yeah. Uh, but just for being like, <laughs> no, nah, we want to sit here. He was like, your boy or girl. <laughs> still, that's yeah. Come on. I got to get out of here. <laughs> yeah. My taxes are due. I got to get to the post office. This guy <laughs> does not like philosophical conversations. No. <laughs> He's driving a bus. Yeah. He's got shit to do. Yeah. I can't, guy, I can't. Can you imagine? Uh, that's like when we talk about, like, like when I told my, when, when, Non-binary came into the lexicon. Yeah, it was in most. I, I I called my parents. And I recorded it. <laughs> yeah, and I was like, "Do you know about non-binaries?" And my mom was like, "Do what?" <laughs> like, <laughs> you know, people that are neither boy nor female, and like, you could hear literally wheels in their heads. Being like, <laughs> <laughs> like break it apart Yeah And they're like yeah. I, I My dad's like I don't I, What <laughs> <laughs> This bus driver Is totally that guy Yeah you know? My mother yeah. Yesterday my, She asked my My wife How's school going She told her About the gender class And uh, she brought up The thing about the babies And my mother Just blurts out No As a parent It's your job To tell them What they are <laughs> <laughs> yeah. like, And that's it what, you know? It's like What they're teaching Them not to do <laughs> Right Exactly Exactly what they're saying not to do yeah no you tell them you're a boy get over it you're a boy like boy things yeah, yeah. it's uh th that's it i mean you know our generation we're learning it every day it's i mean i mean it's, we weren't talking about this last year like it's coming swiftly yeah and you're trying to digest it and trying to do the right thing and trying to that generation it's like i don't know why my blood pressure is so high yeah <laughs> yeah i, I can't I, I i can't sleep without peeing five times <laughs> what you're a trans hooey yeah <laughs> i don't care i also think about this sometimes even though i don't hear it really discussed is how this issue and i don't want to like you know diminish the people that are going through their identity crisis but it feels like it is a not an issue that would ever be covered in a place where they're lacking for food you know no words, or like, at war yeah it's yeah like, if you're in the congo and you're like hold on a second though why you keep telling me to line up with the dudes? And they're like, wait, what? Yeah. Like, right, exactly. I'm not buying it. And they're like, why are you bringing this up? There's a lion right there. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. It's like, it's only where things are comfortable that things like this become well, yes. an issue. Well, because yeah. everyone's, I mean, yeah, we're not in survival mode. We're, right. in, we're in luxury mode. Right. We're in, right. you know, theoretically, the ability to make art. Because if you could be there yeah. and be like, I want to talk about my gender. And they'd be like, we're going through a drought, if you don't yeah. mind holding it. <laughs> Until yeah. the spring, maybe we could talk about it yeah. then. Yeah. And not to get all political, but it was like, you know, the California and New York are, are kind of going through this and kind of intellectually getting their head around it. And then they tell people in areas where none of the fathers have jobs and they're all freaked out on opioids. And they're like, you've got to change your bathrooms. And they're yeah. like, yeah. dude, we're what? dealing with some other shit right yeah, now. Yeah. There's no jobs in this town we right. grew up in. And we're like, yeah, but... You know, everybody's got a P word, and like they're like, and there's not, not a now. priority. Not, yeah. not now, not right now. And yeah. that, I think yeah. that was, I think that's what their reaction was. Is like, you know what? You're not in charge right now. We have other stuff we got to take care yeah, of. For yeah. sure, priority. It's understandable things. though. When you know, yeah, your priority is not that. Oh, of course. Um, sometimes you know, I don't know. Sometimes you just need to make a change, and I think this is a really good example of a change that somebody mm -hmm. needs to make. You mm -hmm. know. Now, at this age, Martina <laughs> desperately wanted to look like Pamela Anderson. So after 10 years and several cosmetic surgeries, Martina <laughs> no. transformed her looks into yeah. this. Wow, those are pretty subtle tits she got done. But she wasn't done. 
Six months ago, Martina made worldwide headlines with her most shocking transformation yet mm. through chemical injections and body modification. Martina now considers herself a black woman. Here's her story. <laughs> Look at the horror. It's just the horror <laughs> and all the black people. <laughs> They're so uh, mad at it. That should be our new screensaver, by the way. It's so great. That is <laughs> dumbfounded, <laughs> nauseous, angry, hilarious. And then, and then laughing. <laughs> oh my God. That is you so know what amazing. I wow. love about this is that Maury Povich has to treat this like it's a real He treats all that's the real thing. trick of it. He does that's his yeah. gift. The, like the most baseline. <laughs> Bullshit, like unethical, <laughs> undignified, yeah. and he's basically like, "This is sixty minutes." Yes, <laughs> I he know. Treats those pieces, <laughs> yeah, and that's why he gets away with it because they're like, "More, he's a respectable guy." He's yeah. a fucking doing garbage. <laughs> <laughs> I know I, he, the amount of sa hand sanitizer in his dressing room <laughs> after he talks to you. <laughs> he does not Can consider you himself. Imagine, you know, like some artists. <laughs> You know, hate their audience or their fans. Yeah. Right? Yes. Can you imagine the level of like that he hates everything? <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah. And, you know what I mean? Yes. Oh my God. Because he's definitely, I'm sure, a bit of an elitist. Of Gotta course. be. And like to. He is, but he, I don't know. I did a radio show once and he was on, we were both on as guests. Uh huh. And he was talking about it and like, he wasn't really shitting on it. Like he, really? Yeah, he was like he is an elitist. Like he's yeah. got these beautiful glasses and he's dressed, you know, yeah, like expensive clothes. But the, he he doesn't either. He keeps up the game really well, yeah. or he really just believes like, no, this is just what I do. It's just a crazy show. Yeah. Or he knows that he is blessed enough to find a lane like this, right, and yeah. that this is this is his lane, and he's locked it in, and he's made a great living. Oh, oh my god. god! Why why yeah. poo poo it? Like when you it's see a couple great. of those tracks, right. he's probably like, no, yeah. we're definitely going to keep doing. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> right. season fifty. Who's your father? Yeah, yeah right. sure. No, who's yeah. your father? Yes, yeah. yeah. <laughs> house in the Hamptons. Yeah. Yes, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> For sure. We'll definitely. I can look yeah. at his still shot. That shot is so great. He's the best. This guy's he, is the, he is the best. He's, he's confused so and angry <laughs> and upset. I wanted to look like a Barbie. I want to create a more beautiful body. Like a Barbie with long blonde hairs and long legs. Oh, my God. But much bigger breasts. Mm. Look at those tits. Oh, it's, wow. Can I, it's, those I, are I mean, look, comical tits. I'm not, I'm not black, so... The, the black part of her. Be. I could if I wanted. <laughs> yeah. That part I understand is a cultural identity and it's really fucked up to just be like, I'm black now. But the tits are like, that doesn't they take even away look from good. Everything. Yeah, no. like it's not even good. It, no it can, has to hurt. No one can Wait, you're focus. Saying, <laughs> you're saying it's not good? <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't look fucking sweet from, from where I'm sitting. I mean, maybe it's a girl. Girl guy thing, but yeah, those are pretty. <laughs> those are pretty good. Those are called perfect. Yeah, <laughs> you get those for your wife. Oh my god! Very stretchy special bread implants. What? And also, what? I got a nose job, mm. and I also had a liposuction to get long Barbie legs. Oh, her face is completely different. Yeah, she was kind of cute here. Wow. Yeah, like her, just her face. This isn't. See, this isn't terrible. I mean, this is ridiculous. It's ridiculous, but yeah, it isn't yeah. terrible. Yeah. It's okay. I mean, there's I girls in LA. Oh, boy. To change my skin color. And now I'm the proud owner of a black skin. Today, Martina says she has changed her race <laughs> and now identifies as a black woman. <laughs> <laughs> How do you think this interview is going to go? <laughs> oh, my God. Wow. That, That's pretty great. That is. So she yeah. knows the struggle now. Yeah, of course. I mean, all you have to do is change your skin color, right? <laughs> oh my Culturally, God. now you're black. We run the industry now. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I like myself, but I also like to do photos. But on the photos, I can see if you have the curves of Pamela Anderson, yeah. you, the photos would be much more better. So, so Does she what? look at that picture of Pamela Anderson and think, I did it? <laughs> Oh, I didn't she like. I look got at her, there. Look at no. her necklace. It says "Black Girls Rock." Black Girls yeah. Rock. Fuck. Did Maury? Uh, something tells me Maury's <laughs> production team gave that to her. Do you have any jewelry? <laughs> we got this crazy shit on. This is gonna look great on you. You look crazy. You cannot say we gave it to you. You know that's right. Like, <laughs> you keep it. <laughs> right. I was like, oh, okay. Uh, look at this. I got this implant set. It's oh, really boy. stretchy. Yes. And. What? 
Didn't you, w w when did you get injections to look darker? Just January. Also in middle of January, I got three injections in the belly, and That's after it? the first week, you can see going darker, darker, and darker. But today is a pale day. This is going to put tanning salons out of business. I know. I know. Three shots in the tummy, and you're good? You're good, man. Yeah, I, I, that's true. I, why would you even burn you your skin? You think you're a black person? Yeah. Eighty <laughs> <laughs> percent. I have to learn a lot. I know. You have to learn a lot. Yeah. Well, oh, at least she's open. Yeah. <laughs> she wants yeah. to learn, man. Yeah. I know. I feel a lot of this stuff. I you think. feel it? Yeah. Really? Yeah. Well, Just we... because your skin is dark? No. Also, um, at, at um. Beginning, I only wanted to have more tan. Yes. But mm -hmm. when I got in my these injections, yes. and the first three months, yeah, I like the contrast of long blonde hair <laughs> and dark skin. But then okay, I now the uh, <laughs> your, eye, your eye color is also changing. She's uh, he's fully exploiting us severely yeah. mentally. Yeah. Yes, <laughs> so so completely. Yeah, yeah. She's real. She's this deranged. Is, this is like a bus stop conversation. Yeah. Like, yeah? <laughs> yeah right when exactly. are you going back to your planet? Like, soon. Yeah. Oh, it's good. It's good. <laughs> good. And you keep looking around to see yeah. where, where you're going to make a move, and yeah. they attack you. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you're so right, and that's but that's Maury's gift. Is that's, he legitimizes yeah. Yeah. the absolute insanity well, that is this woman? Yeah, because he's also like, dancing. He's dancing the line. Of yeah. being like of asking a sincere question, wanting it. Then he's also got to play to the crowd that right. knows it's bullshit. He's like, really, but not too much. Right. Where she feels like, oh, you're totally mocking me. That's so it's a like, gift. That's it's a right. Very, yeah. that, that is. And this a is gift. probably his tenth show he's done today. Right. Yeah, right. <laughs> it's a delicate dance he does. <laughs> he really. There's no. That's why it's called Maury. Yeah. God, it's good. <laughs> yeah, I broke colors. It's changing. The regrowing hairs is also changing. As a, right. Meanwhile. I can see my recurring hairs uh, are all Oh, I could use that. So uh, this is the extensions version, yes. Your husband, Michael, is here, isn't yep. he? Mm -hmm. Michael, <laughs> nice to see you. Mm -hmm. uh, may I might as well ask you, do you feel black? I'm a medium. Uh, I have got a dark You're a medium. I'm a medium. I'm a medium. Oh my God. He talks to dead people? <laughs> You also said, I am black, that is my race. I can't wait to go to Africa because I hear the food is tasty. <laughs> it's not? It's not? <laughs> That's what I heard. Are you saying it's not? <laughs> yeah. Do you think you're offending anyone who is so good. naturally black? No. I don't, I, don't, I don't want to attack them. I know some... Uh, to um, feel attacked, but um, it's not my attention to attack somebody, okay. and it's not a it's not a media um, attention stuff. Right. It's um, I feel it for myself. It's I mental illness. Um, talk to people who want to talk with me about it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So that's that is totally. He just like walks down. Like he's just like you can go down Skid Row and be like, you want to be on TV? Like, yeah. Sure. Yeah. Yeah. There was a guy who was going to Penn Station the other day, and he was a white guy, like probably 28, maybe, no shirt on, <laughs> just like. Sneakers and like a baggy, baggy like uh, running pants, and he's like eating a sandwich, and he's rolling on the ground. He's getting up like aggressive, like he's in a mosh pit by himself. Like, whoa, whoa! <laughs> like, you you want to yeah. come down and talk yeah. about this? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Would you like to be on TV? Yeah, yeah, I love TV. <laughs> so we have, um, you know, uh, a lot of times we Lord. we feature <laughs> dad boners on our show, uh -huh. and. A dad boner is somebody, is a, it's a dad, somebody uh -huh. in our age range who gets very excited. <laughs> um, and we've, we've had to then break it down into two <laughs> lanes. Uh -huh. There's the, un, like the real thrill is when somebody gets super excited about something they shouldn't get excited about. Like, right. For instance, um, this guy excited about <laughs> uh, the, the, the highway in Canada. It's like, why are you... <laughs> Why are you this excited about a highway, you know? Like, this guy. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Well, here we are. This is the Trans-Canada Highway, baby. And we are standing in beautiful, sunny British Columbia. Uh, I mean, he's... <laughs> it's pretty great. Right? It's like... <laughs> it's a divided highway. Joy. Ooh, 
Oh, <laughs> I'm winded. <laughs> oh, the story that this road tells. I mean, I mean then he, he basically almost comes. Like, yeah. listen oh, to him. one more time down the middle. Oh, 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 this is a downhill section, fortunately. Oh, 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 Excited about an eclipse, right. right? But then you're like, well, that's actually something to <laughs> right. get excited about. But it gets, gets a little more excited, yeah. right? Yeah. yeah. So somebody uh, here's a dad boner this week, but we feel like it's a justified one. Oh, um, well, and you can see why. I'll just oh. show you. I'm not that. So these guys are on a boat. You are a fucking <laughs> yeah. vagina, Taylor. You gaff. Give me the fuck. Oh, oh, wait, wait. Oh, my God. God. It's a big goat. Fuck. Wait. Oh, God. God. Oh, God. Oh, They're very oh, excited. But look at that. Wow. <laughs> Sharks are just <laughs> reaching <laughs> in the open water. Wow. They're losing their minds. <laughs> yeah, but I get it. I get that yeah. for sure. So I some, mean, how boring is fishing normally? I know. Yeah. You see sharks Anything? reaching in the water. I mean, you got more bait. Oh my god! Oh my god! Get on him! I am. I am. Dude, this is fucking sick. <laughs> I love that. That's I love great. That I mean, that's yeah. why they're so stoked because it's been a boring fucking it's such day a boring fishing. Day. Oh. Like, yeah. That's like the one thing that happened. This is fucking yeah. sick. <laughs> yeah. You want another beer? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Should we try over there by that rock? I think maybe. I caught a fish over there once. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I know. Oh my god, a shark! <laughs> yeah. yeah, it's so crazy. Yeah, it's so crazy. Uh, yeah, usually you're just like, it's hot, it's still hot out. The sun's burning me. Yeah. How's work? How's work going? Sounds good. Yeah. You still, uh, you still an hour commute? Yeah, both ways. That's not so bad. <laughs> That's not so bad. <laughs> yeah. You know, you listen to podcasts and stuff. That's probably good. To, it's good to kill the time. Yeah, it is books on tape. Yeah. <sighs> How's Christine? She's, <laughs> She's great. You don't even correct her. You don't even correct her. She's great. Yeah, she doesn't give a shit. She's great. Um, somebody sent in this fucking boring, huh? insane. The worst. I worked on this uh, show one time for Comedy Central about it's called what is it called like Thirty Minutes Over Washington or something. It was basically where we were mocking uh, politicians' ad campaigns and the way that there is one. This is in Virginia, where they tried to, I guess, use Top Gun. Uh huh. But like this dude put uh -huh. out this ad. This is a real ad this airing. For a congressman. That guy's running for Congress. Oh my God. So like done a, like Top Gun. Yeah. He's got my vote. Here you go, Congresswoman Comstock. And that's the Hey Dan. Isn't you know, that Congresswoman Comstock back there at the bar? Sure is. That you can't get her to hold a town hall. Whoa. You know what's funny? He has a little Tom Cruise to his face. Yeah. Oh, He's got a little yeah. bit like someone in high school said he looked like Tom Cruise. Yeah. And this is the moment where he puts it all he to puts it all You're right. You're <laughs> and you right. know that his like his his campaign manager was like, You're a vet. You're gonna wear a shirt that says vet. In this ad, <laughs> right? Oh, he was yeah. like, "Are you sure?" And he was like, "A hundred percent." Like, you're gonna wear veteran, <laughs> so that when people are voting, they remember that part too. Besides your awesome Tom Cruise commercial, <laughs> you can't get a town hall. Do you want better than that? We've lost that love and feeling. No, Dan. Oh, no. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. Are you ready to cringe or no? So Oh, it's God. so embarrassing. Oh, no. Wait, can I put something over my head? Do you have something like <laughs> a noose? Cover my face with? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that extra uh, penis skin? No. You never hold town halls anymore with constituents. Uh, oh, boy. Uh, <laughs> You're trying hard not to show it, but Barbara, Barbara, you know it. 
The only mistake he's made is that he picked the wrong Tom Cruise movie. Oh, this right. is out of straight out of cocktail. All right, this is cocktail. This is cocktail Wait, when he's flipping the bottles and right, stuff, and the whole bar stops and listens to him. Right. And he, are you sure he, this isn't Top Gun? Well, he's combining elements of Top Gun with the oh. scene. Oh, you think that? Right? No, no, this no. Scene I think isn't. he's all Top Gun. This is but he's made a mistake. He should have oh, done, done cocktail. Cocktail. I see what oh, you're saying. Oh, okay, I okay. see. Interest. A little Kokomo. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He should have been flipping bottles. <laughs> the craziest uh, thing about cocktail like, is that like the whole bar stops and like right, like, like <laughs> hundreds of people stop and like turn as Tom Cruise so says stupid. something about tequila. What's his his ad could have been like? Our district's going to shit and it's boring around here. And just like <laughs> pour drinks and be like, let's have some fucking fun again. Let's get hammered. Yeah. <laughs> but I I you think lost oh, that boy. Oh. oh boy. Uh, I, I, I bet uh, this works for him, though. You think so? Yeah, I don't know. there's a lot of dopes out there that are like, "This is great." This guy, <laughs> this guy's then, fun. Then the opposition walks out, <laughs> like they, she leaves, right? Nice work, Dan. Nice Thanks, work. Maverick. Oh boy! Thanks, Thanks Maverick. Maverick. Oh. And then, Nice Final. work, Dan. Thanks, Maverick. <laughs> oh, politicians uh, are so douchey. I'm Dan Helmer. I approve of town halls, bad singing, and this message. Uh, ah, th- he's funny. Good least, closing line. Yeah. Hey, and yeah. he's self-aware. I mean, at the end, he's aware that it's yeah. ca- kind of corny. Ve- a veteran uh, T-shirt with the army jacket and, uh, over it. Like, US Army. in case you're wondering what branch. <laughs> 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 he's running for. He is a, a Democrat running for tenth district in. Uh, Virginia, Dan Helmer. Wow. Uh, wish you the best, Dan. I please keep making these. They're really good. <laughs> God. <laughs> Whew, that's so uncomfortable. Yeah, isn't it? Like, I'm sweating. It's, it's uh, more uncomfortable than the nail lady. Yeah. No. The nail lady's like, really? whoa. Yeah. But this is like the seek. Like, uh, yeah. just, like, just made you sad. Yeah. yeah. It's like. Um, it did bum me out, too. It's like yeah. when someone tries to sing, uh, you know, on, on those shows, like on those. Audition shows where you're like, yeah. God damn it, stop singing. Like, you can't do it. No one told you. Why do we feel gr- Like, why did it make us sad? Because I think you can register, especially if you're a performer, when you're like, this is, bad. This, this is a bad show. <laughs> you're, doing, you're not doing well right now. Right? It makes you uncomfortable yeah. to see or, somebody like. Or even worse, it's when you're watching that person and they're killing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And yeah. you know it's bad, and other people are approving of it. That, that's true. And you're yeah. just like, oh, what uh, do I, am I that far from what that is? Yeah. yeah. You know yeah. what I mean? That like, oh, yeah. maybe we're all just hacky. Yeah, yeah, true. There's something that registers differently, I think, if you perform when you watch a performance. Yeah. Right? You, re- you, you read it differently. Oh, completely. Yeah. Maybe that's what it is. I'm going to go now. Yeah. But yeah, I think it, Are you what depressed? It, yeah. I'm so depressed. I think it's that it's it, it was so out of his comfort zone. Like, it was painful to watch him That's a good it. point. Yeah. Right? He was yeah. like, Th- thanks, Maverick. We did it. Like, And uh, he's just staring at whoever yeah. he's talking to because he, he's terrified. <laughs> yeah. What is it? Yeah, is it, the, is the it the that terror. you know? It's because you know it's bad, right? Like you well, I, I sense that he's not comfortable because he's really inexperienced, and I feel nervous for for him, so I'm oh, like, right. oh, like I'm yeah. so uncomfortable. Like I, <laughs> uh, I want to. You say should that. do um, an ad like this for your net. She has a Netflix special coming out on right? October yeah. 10th. Uh-huh. Yeah, so it's about to come out. What if you did like a hey? Why don't you watch my Netflix special? And we like parody a movie. I would love to. Yeah, do like that. something from Legally Blonde or something. Yeah. <gasps> I love Ella Woods. <laughs> yeah, for sure. Yeah. There's some good lines in there. Yeah, I object. Yeah. <laughs> She's great. It's a great you want, movie. You want to do it? I'd love to do it. Uh, I'd love to do it. That would be cool. At the end, you can turn it camera and be like, I'm Christina P. I, I approve of this message. I like totally. And then. <laughs> like totals. Yeah. All right. I like uh, that idea. That's is cute. there a better one? Is Probably. There... <laughs> Probably. Is there a better, worse idea that I you mean... have for this, Tom? <laughs> um... <laughs> no, is there a better movie than Legally Blonde like you would like to do? Like, is there another favorite? Rocco, that new documentary. Oh we watched. my gosh. Have you Rocco? seen that? Have you watched Rocco's documentary? No. It's on Netflix. Oh my God. If you want oh, to the, the original Rocky? Uh, no. No. It's uh, the Italian porn star, Rocco. I have to pee really bad. Um, <laughs> he does. We're speaking about to of, wrap up. Oh, yeah. speaking of being bummed, yeah, you'll, you'll feel sad and sick. There's a lot oh, really? of sadness, but it's a it's pretty good, right? It's an amazing it's, documentary. It's yeah. a good documentary. Not one to watch when the girls are around. There's nothing Definitely. to watch when the girls are yeah, around. No. <laughs> Literally nothing to watch. Well, I just finished season three of Narcos. Mm. Everything. 
Big thumbs up to that. that yeah. Was oh, you finished it? Excellent. <coughs> we started Ozark. Yeah, I did too. Really good. I'm um, pretty deep into that. A few That's episodes good. In. It is good. Um, but that documentary, it's 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 a wide range of them. I mean, this is a guy who's done really hardcore, crazy porn for 30 years. That's the part that wow. I think to, the most that we stood like that stood out was like, you know, if the guy was like 24, you'd be like, right. yeah. I mean, some people are going to go that way, right? But like the fact that he's 50 something Yeah And he's like I have a wife I have a couple of kids And then he's just like Stepping on necks And like just <laughs> Banging <laughs> For it's, hours It's You're like, violence Dude it's like, so Oh my god intense. Choking girls but With then his fist He's very revealing in it Like he can Yeah Give, yeah. Right, He'll yeah, tell, give like you the inner thoughts Deep dark yeah. thoughts It's really interesting Alright yeah. Maybe so, I'll watch it with the kids Yeah <laughs> Good um, <laughs> uh, Tom Papa Where can people yes. See you um, my podcast is called Come to Papa, and um, we've been doing a lot of uh, live shows with it. It's adorable. Um, just go to TomPapa.com. You can find and the podcast, dates. my tour dates, yeah. all that stuff. I'm going to Eugene, Oregon next week. Mm. Awesome. And Portland. I did both this year. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Where are you doing, Eugene? Uh, Rialto. And no. Uh, no, that's... That's Denver. Or Loveland... Colorado. I don't uh, know where I am. Together. Uh, Eugene, some theater in Eugene. McDonald's the Holtz. The Holtz. Oh, the Holtz. Okay. And then uh, one in Portland. Two great towns. Yeah, I'm love psyched. Oregon. I love going up there. And Tom Papa is an amazing comedian. If you've never seen him, go see him live. He's really one of the best. It's really true. Um, it really is. It's true. You're He's very really fun. good. He's you, really you good. You guys are great too. Very sweet. Um, normal person. Christina P has a new uh, special, Mother Inferior. What? Uh, premiering October 10th on yes. Netflix. So you can queue it up Sweet. right next to your Rocco documentary. Watch them back <laughs> please, to back. Please don't. And then... <laughs> oh, I think I saw a Legally Blonde parody about that special. Yeah, it's pretty good. It's pretty good. <laughs> um, I have... Oh, I put the uh, the signed vinyls of Completely Normal are in the store, if you wanted those. And I also signed um, the leftover posters from the Denver taping. Those are in the store as well. well you just go, did that, right? I did that last weekend. Oh, yeah. how'd it go? It was awesome, man. Yeah? It was a lot of fun. Awesome. Yeah. yeah. Super cool. It's going to yeah. be a great special. I'm That's excited cool. for it. I'm excited for it. It uh, never comes out as good as you think. I know. I know. And it's never I as know. bad as you think. It's, it's exactly that. It's, <laughs> it's, it's just somewhere neither. in the middle. It's somewhere in the middle. Yeah. But always great for the fans. Yeah. Um, but yeah, uh, please go to TomSeguro.com. Check out the, uh, the live dates. I told you Toronto, and uh, we'll see you soon. And the store is there as well. Thank you, Tom, for coming today. This Appreciate is the best. It. You're so fun. good. Like, I love your podcast, and I love that in. you invited me over. It's so I got fun. to meet the dogs. This is a nice place. <laughs> good time. I'm sorry about the street. I couldn't help. Am me. I going to be able to go home? No, you have to stay here. Uh-uh. Oh, how, long, how many days? Just like six, seven days. <laughs> okay, that'll be good. <laughs> All right. We'll see you next week. Thanks a lot, Thank guys. Thank you.
lot. I lot. Okay. How often am I doing this? You have to do it every day until you can control.